thing too. Um, you know, we finished that flew to Vegas. I had to go to Vegas for like a few hours on the other day. And then from there, I went out to the out east <laughs> and um, had a great time. And my son, Mike, was here. So we went out to some jet skiing and like hung out with our friends. And um, which I, I had to splash him with the inaugural splash. But like, you know, he's on the jet ski going like 20 miles per hour. Ugh. Pick it up, buddy. Yeah. And I, you know, I'm doing about like 70, and I just water all on the front. It's such a thrill of the father. And, I, and Michael, I'm proud of you that you were doing 20 miles an hour because of that is smart and that is safe. That is good. I can swim faster than that. <laughs> and then yesterday I went up to to Boston. And I did this great event. It was a Care One Cancer Fund mm -hmm. in, in honor of uh, this gentleman, Dan Grimes. And um, they raised $1.3 million. Here's Dan Grimes in the blue shirt right there. Uh -huh. And um, Tiki Barber was up there with me. Natasha oh, Bedingfield was there who said, yes, Natasha said hello. Her, yeah. And um, this is Dan and Lizzie, uh, Elizabeth. Um, um, uh, what I miss uh, 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 no, I know it. Dan and Elizabeth. Dan and Elizabeth. Yeah, yeah. there we go. They, um, they Strauss. Strauss. Oh, are they affiliated with that? Yeah, Dan and Elizabeth okay. Strauss own this company. And for 35 years, they have been so charitable that they've been recognized as one of the most charitable companies in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. um, and they treat their employees like, like gold. And they run senior care facilities. Oh, that's important. So it's all about hospitality. Right. So Dan worked for them for like seven plus years, found out he had stage four lung cancer, and he's not a smoker. Was playing basketball and just short of breath and found this so they just started these fundraisers for him and the strauss family um raised 1.3 million or over a million bucks great, great. and Excellent. so when natasha benfield performed it was at it was at on uh, fenway our friend neo neo performed I love and um this is my challenge you know, I was surprised when they called me and they said, Mike, would you be a part of this? I was like, it's in Boston, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. I'm going, this is a setup. Boston's, Patriots, oh, Giants. Giants, right, right. I'm no sucker. <laughs> but it ended up being a great deal and they raised a lot of money. I saw this on Twitter. Yeah, that's yeah. the Green Monster. And I wonder if I could smack it out of that puppy. <laughs> I, think, I think I could. I'm looking real mean right there. That's my football look. Come and get some. It was, it was, so, it was very funny because I, as I knew you were in Boston, and I'm like, is he in a tornado right now? But we talked about it, became obsessed with where you were and whether or not you were caught up in this tornado. Yeah, we and, avoided it. And Nicole was in Maine, and she was like, what tornado? Yeah, she was I up mean, at the yeah, I she know, it's so crazy. It's so, it's so funny how it, it's so, such a specific, you know, that is a weather system that is specific to an area. It touches down in an area and goes away. It's and crazy. I saw something on the news today, like a rare tornado in Connecticut or something. Yeah, it's really crazy. Like, really, really crazy.